hey guys welcome back to the channel and in this video we will understand what is cell reaction if you don't know what is representation of cell then i have a small request for you all that please view that video first and then come to this video because if you come after watching that video it will be better for you all to understand this video okay so let's start with the topic so suppose this is the formulation of cell which is given to us as we all know the galvanic cell is represented in this manner so following those rules of representation of cell as we all know the leftmost side metal which is present is our anode that is here pb which is lead which is written on the leftmost side so therefore anode in this process is pb and the one which is written on the rightmost side that is ag silver is our acting as cathode in this reaction so our cathode in this whole process is ag now as we all know that at anode there is an oxidation reaction taking place now what is oxidation oxidation is loss of reaction loss of electrons so this pb atom will lose electrons therefore pb will now lose electrons and turn into pb2 plus so therefore this is what pb2 plus is written in the center as we all know that the ions are written always in the center of that cell formulation now at cathode there is a gain of the electrons taking place so who will gain those electrons not ag ag plus ions will gain electrons and will become ag so as we all know at cathode there is reduction taking place so reduction will be done by ag plus ions so this ag plus ions will take one electron and will get turned into ag but here we have two electrons available so all these electrons are needed to be consumed so in order to consume both these electrons two ag plus ions will take up two electrons okay i then we will now write the complete cell reaction what is a complete reaction complete reaction is nothing but we add this oxidation process taking place and this reduction process taking place in a cell so after adding this we get pbs pb2 plus this is in liquid state plus two electrons i will write over here two electrons plus we add this reaction now two ag plus plus two electrons will give ag now these two electrons and these two electrons get cancelled away so the complete reaction here is pb which is present in the solid state will merge with ag plus 2 ag plus and this will give rise to pb2 plus plus ag so this is our complete cell reaction moving ahead to the next question now suppose next question is magnesium which is present in a solid state mg2 plus ions are produced by this magnesium and this cu2 plus one molar ions are produced by this cu okay so this is the cell reaction formulation which is given to us now let's again do the same process at anode 
what is at the anode the one which is written on the leftmost side so mg is acting as a anode in this cell and the one which is written on the rightmost side what is that cu so cu will be acting as a cathode over here now as we all know that at anode there is oxidation reaction taking place what is oxidation oxidation is nothing but loss of electrons so now this mg will get dissociated into mg2 plus ions it has to get dissociated into ions which are mentioned in the representation of the cell it cannot get dissociated into mg3 plus or mg plus we have to write that ions which are represented in the question itself okay so mg will now get dissociated into mg2 plus so since there is a 2 plus charge so it will give away two electrons and at copper that is at cathode there is reduction taking place so what is reduction now reduction is gain of electrons so who will gain electrons the cu2 plus or cu cu2 plus will gain electrons and become stable that is cu okay the cu2 plus will now gain two electrons and get converted into cu these two electrons lost by mg2 plus are now taken away by this cu2 plus ions okay now let's understand one more question uh i forgot to write a complete reaction now what is complete reaction complete reaction is nothing but the sum of both these reactions this which one oxidation and the one which is reduction so let's write the addition of both of this so mg solid plus two electrons and uh, here on the left hand side is cu2 plus plus two electrons will get converted into cu okay so just these two electrons and these two electrons will get cancelled now right left hand side as it is mg plus cu2 plus will give rise to mg2 plus plus cu so this is your complete cell reaction which is the addition of oxidation and reduction let's understand one more question this question is little bit tricky over here we have given a platinum electrode and in this platinum electrode there is in this platinum electrode there is a hg2 gas present at one atmospheric pressure okay and h plus ions are formed one molar h plus ions are formed and then we are having again silver ions formed by ag solid electrode so let's follow our simple steps the one which is on the leftmost side that is our anode so platinum is acting as an anode over here and the one which is on the rightmost side which is on the rightmost side ag is acting as our cathode okay now the uh, here what hap happens is that h plus ions are produced at anode there is oxidation means what loss of electrons taking place and with due to that that oxidation h plus ions are produced now pt cannot produce h plus ions so who has produced this h plus ions this h plus ions are produced by this hg2 gas which is present in that half cell so this hg2 gas will undergo oxidation not this platinum okay so you have to see which ions are produced and according to that we are, you have to write oxidation and reduction so this hg2 h2 will get dissociate into 2h plus plus it will give away two electrons why i have written 2h plus because h2 there are two atoms of h h so this h2 will get converted into 2h plus plus two electrons it will give away two electrons okay and at the cathode there is ag okay so i write ag at the cathode 
at cathode there is reduction taking place reduction is gain of electrons so who will gain electrons ag plus or ag ag plus will gain electrons and become neutral so here ag plus will gain electrons and become ag but again since there are two electrons lost so we have to take all those two electrons so in order to take both these electrons we write two ag plus over here and so that both these electrons are taken away by ag at ag plus atoms and again the complete reaction that is the addition of oxidation and reduction just add the left hand sides and right hand sides we get h2 2h plus plus two electrons and we add 2ag plus plus two electrons getting converted into normal ag again this a two plus two electrons and two electrons get cancelled and you are left with the complete reaction that is h2 plus 2ag plus ions get converted into 2h plus plus ag so guys this was all about how you will write a cell reaction when a representation of cell is given to you if you have liked this video then do subscribe to the channel and do share this video with your friends and stay tuned for more videos on physics and chemistry